Did you hear about a new AI browser called Comet released recently? My guess is either Google Chrome will copy Comet browser or Comet might even actually replace Google Chrome for good. What is this new AI browser called Comet? What can it actually do? Everything you need to know about the new Comet browser plus 10 things you can do with the Comet browser that will literally save you hours of work in this video. So let's get started. Very quick intro. Comet is the name of the new browser released by Perplexity. You might have already known about Perplexity. It's a generative AI LLM just like ChatGPT or Google Gemini. Now they have released their Perplexity AI powered browser called Comet. But don't mistake Perplexity in Comet browser as something like Gemini in Google Chrome or Microsoft Copilot in Microsoft Edge. You see, Gemini in Google Chrome is simply an AI chatbot available in your web page with very minimal integration. Comet, on the other hand, is a true AI personal assistant. It's easier to show you than to describe. So let's just install Comet browser from the Perplexity website and I'll walk you through 10 super cool things you can do in Comet that you cannot do with any other browser today. By the way, Comet is now available for everyone to download and use. Okay, I've installed the Comet browser. At first glance, this does look like any other browser, right? There's tabs, search bar, tab groups, enter any website and it's decent fast as well. The first difference you will notice is when you search for anything on the search bar, instead of doing a Google or web search, it directly asks the perplexity browser. For example, when I search for restaurants near me, you would expect a Google search. Instead, Perplexity researches the web and then gives me the result. The advantage of this kind of research is you can ask questions in natural language with multiple filters, which Google may not understand. For example, Indian restaurants near me that have at least four plus ratings that is open until 9 p.m and have paneer tikka masala in their menu. Now, this takes an extra second or two, but the results are extremely customized. Same query on Google results in a simple web search, which I think I'll have to spend more time browsing through each and every results. And I have to figure out myself about the ratings and vegetarian options or other stuff. By the way, if you still prefer Google to be your default search, you can do that in the Comet browser settings. Hold on. You might think that Google Gemini website can also do this, right? Yes, that's extra one step but also wait till what else can this perplexity AI do. Perplexity in Comet can act like a real personal assistant. Think of it as some person actually sitting in front of your computer and using your browser and you're just instructing that person to do the job for you. Let me show you. Let's say I'm planning a picnic and I need some things like a picnic mat, paper plates, cups, sodas, snacks and some other things. Instead of me going to the website like Walmart, researching stuff and ordering, I can simply ask Comet to do it for me. I will go to the new tab. Here I'll ask Perplexity that I am planning a picnic and I need to buy the following things from Walmart website. Find the products and add it to my Walmart cart. Two 5x7 picnic mats, one large Diet Coke bottle, 12 inch paper plates, at least 25 in numbers, at least 25 paper cups for water, one Lay's chips family size, one insect repellent spray, three picnic chairs, eight ounce water bottle, full pack, and a loaf of sliced white bread. As soon as I type this, Perplexity will actually use your browser to open Walmart, search for specified items, and add them to your cart. To see what it's actually doing, just click here and it will show everything that's going on behind the scenes. You can actually see it opening the website, typing things, searching for items, adding it to your cart, etc. The best part, if it needs your input in deciding something, it can even ask you to clarify. You can leave it and come back in a few minutes and if you open a Walmart website in a new tab, you can see every single item that I asked for has been added to my cart which I can just click pay and purchase. It even got the quantities right. 
माइंड ब्लोइंग राइट नाउ डोंट थिंक दैट दिस इज सम इंटीग्रेशन बिटवीन परप्लेक्सिटी एंड द वॉलमार्ट वेबसाइट नो यू कैन डू दिस ऑन एनी वेबसाइट फॉर एग्जाम्पल हियर आई विल आस्क परप्लेक्सिटी टू सर्च on Amazon for the highest rated and most reviewed power bank with at least 10000 mAh and add it to my cart it'll take a couple of minutes open amazon website do the searching for you and it'll add the product to your amazon cart let me show you another insane use case i've logged into the perplexity with my gmail account and since it has a direct access I can ask perplexity with something like open gmail find marketing related emails which seems like pure advertisements or spam and unsubscribe the five most spamming emails now perplexity will sift through my gmail look for top spammers or advertisers and actually do the unsubscribing for me if i had to do all this by myself it would have taken me an hour to do it literal time saving right there unsubscribing done not just that i can ask perplexity when is my next meeting today or add an event on my calendar at 3 pm at seattle with the title meeting with tim cook and perplexity will be that assistant and do the job for you now do you see why comet is superior to google chrome or edge comet is actually doing the work for you it's a true ai agent are you convinced already I have more mind blowing use cases for you. I'm planning for a 2 day trip to Olympic National Park. Since Perplexity is an AI chatbot at its core, I'll first ask to plan for a 2 day trip to Olympic National Park from Linwood with some must visit places and exploring some local eateries. Being a chatbot, it has created a nice 2 day itinerary for me. Now, I will ask Perplexity to add all this information to a new page in my Notion website with the title Olympic Trip Itinerary. Look at it go. Just by chatting, I have summarized and saved all this information to my notes app. Neat, right? Now, it works the other way around too. Let's say I have a Notion workspace with hundreds of pages and folders. Instead of searching hundreds of pages or even cross-referring pages with the Notion I can simply open a tab on Comet browser and ask look my notion site and tell me when is my daughter's next school closure day. You will be surprised how Comet and Perplexity opens my notion, searches my pages and finds the exact information I need. You may have a question. Is it even safe and private to let an AI company access my emails and notion notes like this? You see that's why this feature is coming as a new AI powered comet browser. All this work is happening locally on your browser. It's opening your tab, doing operations on your machine and giving you answers. And that's why same functionalities won't work on the same perplexity website when used through a different browser like Chrome. I think you get the idea now, right? It's up to your imagination to ask the agent whatever you want it to do and let it handle the job for you. Here are a few more features Comet browser has built in. Let's say I am browsing some 10 websites on different tabs researching for a nice car to buy. I can ask Perplexity to go view the 10 related tabs and summarize the details in there for me. Perplexity will take those 10 web pages and summarize it for me. I can even ask questions where the information is spread out in those 10 tabs which would be difficult to do manually. Here's one more. I have like 50 different tabs open for various different things. It's a complete mess. I can simply ask Perplexity to organize all the open tabs for me. Voila. It has organized them into nice tab groups. Well, Chrome can do this, but here's this insane part. I will now ask Perplexity to close all the tabs that I have opened before 10 days, or I will ask Perplexity to close all the tabs related to dress shopping, or I can even ask Perplexity something like move all the car shopping related tabs to a new tab group. All right, there's so much more that you can do with it. 
if you want to see all those possibilities to better use Comet browser, let me know in the comments below and I will make a video just showcasing the use case of Comet. Personally, I use it a lot for research and shop on Amazon automatically, managing my Gmail calendar and emails. I ask Perplexity to summarize one or more open web pages for me. I even ask Perplexity in Comet to go find the best flight and hotel by analyzing all the combination dates and places. It has really saved me hours and gotten me a cheaper hotel and flight tickets because it was able to find a date, airline and flight combination that I would have missed searching for myself. So try it out, it's available for everyone now. This is not a sponsored video or anything at all. I genuinely feel that Comet is a big step towards a real AI based browser. And very soon, other browsers will copy these features, which is gonna save us a lot of time. And for more such AI and learning related videos, subscribe and hit that like button. I'll see you all in the next one. Until then, this is Sanjana. Bye-bye.